Yeah, this is the place we pray. Oh. Thank you very much, everyone. My name is Sami Takahashi. I'm uh, uh, one of the board members of Asahi Baseball Association. I wanted to have this um, Asahi Memorial Service. As you may have seen the movie several years ago, uh, the legendary Asahi Baseball team used to play here. Good afternoon to all the participants of the Asahi Memorial Service. It is my pleasure to lead a message on behalf of Consul General of Japan in Vancouver, Hattori Takashi, who is unable to attend this memorial service today. We gather here to pay tribute to the Vancouver Asahi team players who gave their community dreams and hope and brought Japanese and Canadians together through baseball, but sadly one never, never able to officially play again at this Powell Street grounds after 1942. Today, through shared love of baseball, the Vancouver Asahi and Japanese baseball teams, as well as Canada and Japan, are firmly connected again. I pay tribute to the Asahi players for their great contributions that they have made to strengthen the Japanese and Japanese Canadian community, uphold Japan's good reputation in Canada, and build a foundation for firm friendship between Japan and Canada. Thank you very much. Thank you, Council Imabura. The next speaker is uh, Mr. Ed Kaminishi, uh, K. Kaminishi's son. Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Ed Kaminishi. My, this is my father, K. Kaminishi, the sole survivor of the Asahi baseball team. I'd like to first of all thank Sammy for organizing this memorial service. Bishop Aoki for his blessing and Council General for her words. So I'm going to just give a quick speech on behalf of my father, my dad. From all the managers, coaches, and players, thank you for your thoughtfulness in having the service honoring and homaging, uh, giving homage to the Vancouver Asahi baseball team. Thank you for, to all the Asahi fans, past and present, for your loyal support throughout the years that we played. Thank you to Pat Adachi of Toronto, Norio Goto of Nagoya, Japan, and all the historians and writers of the Asahi baseball team legacy. Without these people, the Asahi history would have faded away never to be heard of again. These stories that have been written resulted in the resurrection and the success of the new Vancouver Shin Asahi team. Thank you everyone for attending this service. Thank you. Thank you. Good afternoon. On behalf of the Shin Asahi Baseball Club, it is a great honor to be here today to pay tribute to the Asahi players in this memorial service on the grounds of the on the grounds where they played their beloved game of baseball. It is here the community forgot the Japanese community forgot about the racial differences at the time, and where everyone could co simply come together and enjoy the excitement of the game. It is unfortunate the team was disbanded during the war in 1941 and Asahi would never play at Powell Street ever again. However, today, we are here to remember their time as the field and to remember the great Asahi players on these grounds and that they have been and will continue to be great inspiration to the Shin Youth Asahi as we keep the legacy alive. The Shin Asahi has grown from 14 players in 2014 and we have impacted hundreds of players since then. We continue to instill the respect, hard work, and sportsmanship 
that Asahi players are known for and will continue for generations to come. We're also very fortunate to take our youth players to Japan every two years and give them opportunities to experience Japanese baseball at its roots. Again, I would like to thank our guests, and namely, our spiritual leader, Kei Kalinishi. And again, thank you, Asahi players of past. We will, for, we will forever cherish the legacy you've left, and thank you, guests, attending this memorial service today. Thank you. Hi, let us uh, perhaps begin with silent reflection or meditation to pay our tribute to the past Asahi players as well as all the supporters who made Asahi baseball team possible. Thank you, Reverend Aoki. To close this ceremony, I just wanted to say uh, 25 years ago or so, there was a movie called Field of Dreams. And in that movie, Kevin Costner heard the word, if you build it, they will come. I hope uh, their spirits are here today. And then young uh, Asahi players are here. If you could give them a round of applause. So they will, they will continue to carry the legacy of the Asahi team here. And then once again, please uh, give a big hand to Kei Kaminishi. Thank you very much, Kei-san. Thank you everybody for gathering for this service. Thank you, uh, distinguished guests. Thank you very much. Thank you.
good spots, you know, not too much body contact and clean spots, you know, that's why I, I like that, coach uh, no high school no tournament, I think I'm I don't mean, uh, better than the professional. So bright and, uh, you know, really good. Still a base. Still a base, of course. Takai Toshio to Moshimasu. I am from the country of Japan. I am from the country of Japan. あたりますの、この朝日軍を応援しておったというふうなことで、ま、明治大正にかけて昔の方がこの日本人で初めて野球をやっておられたというふうなことで、私もテレビなんかを見させていただいて、あの、本当に感動をいたしました。で、昔のね、その部分を今もこうやって皆さん方が伝えて皆さん方が大事にしてくださってるというのが本当にあの一番嬉しいです。本当にありがとうございました。はい。Frankly。Hello, I'm Rachel Davidson. I was born and raised in Vancouver. I'm from the North Shore, but I really appreciate the Japanese Canadian community here in um, Powell Street and Oppenheim Park. And I hope for the Asahi baseball team to carry on for a long, long time. K Kamish is such a great role model in the Japanese community. And I really go for Shin Asahi and Asahi Go. Thank you. Hi, <clears throat> my name is Sammy Takahashi. I'm one of the founding members of the new Asahi team. It's called the Asahi Baseball Association. My jersey, this is uh, what my younger son Cody uh, wore several years ago. He, he was one of the first members of the uh, new Asahi team. And uh, uh, this is where the original Asahi players, legendary uh, Asahi players used to play. And then what happened probably you, you know, but uh, the war broke out between Japan and the Allied forces. So that happened in 1941, December. Ever since then, Asahi members were not allowed to come back here and play or practice baseball at all. Today, I, I was honored to have organized this memorial service for uh, the legendary Asahi team and Asahi players here, especially with a special guest, Kei Kaminishi, who is 100 years old. He was one of the original members of the Asahi players. And we have few distinguished guests, uh, Toshio Takai, one of the great, great, great grandson of Gihei Kuno. Also, we had another great grandson of Gihei Kuno, uh, who was born and raised here. And then Tomio Fukumura uh, representing the Asahi team and a few others. And then I was very happy that uh, we could do this service. Uh, we invited Reverend Aoki of uh, Vancouver uh, Buddhist Temple. He did a service for us and uh, we were very, 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 very happy. We wanted to really play tribute to the Asahi members. Thank you very much. Tomio Fukumura, Vice President of the Asahi Baseball Association. Uh, we are here today at the Powell Street Festival um, and a big part of it today was we attended the memorial for the past Asahi players. Um, it was the first time we've ever done this and um, with the, the, the graciousness of, of the Powell Street Festival organization um, and in, in attendance were many guests, distinguished guests and of course uh, we had some relatives of the past Asahi, but more importantly, we had Kei Kamanishi attend today. Um, 
we celebrated his 100th birthday this past January and um, he's always been um, an icon um, one of the reasons why we continue this um, he is the legend he is the reason why we continue this legacy um, and from him we always get this power this sense of this energy um, from Kane. Um, in the past years we went to Kamloops where he lives and we played many many games um, but the number of tournaments because of COVID uh, we haven't really had the opportunity but to see Kay again today um, it really it, it, it brings so much joy to me personally and to many of our players um, our newer players as well and, and it's really important that the, the younger generation really understands where this all came from and to understand the whole Asahi legacy and so I think having Kay with the boys today just a few of the boys but when Kay's around it just totally brings a new dimension to what we do um, we are going to Japan next year um, and our boys are really working hard towards that the fundraising the volunteer and again adding a new dimension to help them mature as uh, as adults so again um, we're very proud of what we're doing and uh, I'd like to thank everybody in, in Vancouver and Canada for their support and uh, we continue to go um, and to help uh, Asahi continue to grow. Thank you very much. Asahi baseball team, Gamba Tene. Then we'll go Asahi on three. One, two, three. Asahi. Asahi. Memorial. Thank you so much for keeping our history alive.